Hey, it's Sunday, September 15th. Hey. I love it to just always throw my camera in your face. Yeah. We got Bender right now. Huh? We got Bender right now. Oh, no one saw it. No one pays attention. I only have four followers, so it's fine. Um, it's our last day here at this awesome resort. Feeling all bougie. We're having lunch at the doghouse. And it's apparently a sports game. So they didn't get us our regular table. But we're having mimosas and breakfast. So I don't know. And then we're going to... We have to check out of this hotel today, and we both have separate hotels. So I'm going to another Hilton, and he's going to a place called uh, what's your, what's the name of your hotel? Mardi Gras. The Mardi Gras. That sounds fun. So we'll go to his hotel first and check it out, and then we'll go to my hotel. We're checking out of the room. He does. He just want to be in this episode. So <laughs> too late. You're in it. I'm so honorary. Anyways, we're done here because I only had two nights here. Trying to go down the lobby. Have a little drink and my friends are gonna pick us up and take us to our respective hotels. So our second journey begins on this trip. What a fun trip it is. This place was great. We felt bougie for a couple yeah, days. Awesome. Bougie for a couple days. Now he's going to a place and I'm going to a different place. But it's still gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. So we're just in the lobby having some, just a drink. We're waiting for Anthony to come pick us up. So I'm off to the restroom and I'm gonna go say goodbye to this casino. Bye, World Resorts. We'll be back again soon. Say goodbye to our lobby. This is our lobby. Look how beautiful it is. It's so grand. We're leaving. I'm going from here and we're gonna drop Justin off at the Mardi Gras. Hopefully he can get in a little bit early. And then from there, we're gonna go to my Hilton and see if I can get in there. And then I just found out that I apparently have a podcast interview tonight for Horror Realm. And even though it was on my calendar, I completely forgot. And that's unlike me to forget that. But that's just how much fun I've been having. And I've been caught up in doing Riker stuff and filming a lot. So to the Horror Realm, I deeply apologize. I will be in my hotel room and I will sneak away and do this interview. I'm so embarrassed that I completely forgot. Because I get so excited about doing these things that I never forget. But, alas... I forgot. And so it's set up for six o'clock tonight. Also, I wanted to say happy birthday to my manager, Matt. Today's his birthday. He's in West Virginia. So I texted him at midnight his time. But yeah. All right. So we're just waiting for Anthony to get here to pick us up. Okay. So I'm staying at this really awesome Hilton that I just stayed at. It's like an apartment. So I'm going to show it to you. And my friends are with me. We're just waiting to go eat. But watch. Watch this place. It's a living room. It's got a full kitchen. Don't look at those bitches. Uh, this is like the second bedroom with its own closet and then there's a bathroom this place is amazing i should have stayed here first full kitchen and then there's like a patio <laughs> there's anthony you guys remember anthony's been on the laundry floor <laughs> laundry full laundry and then this is my bedroom right here look at this thing i got a full bedroom i got a full bathroom that's my bathroom i got a whole walk-in closet this fucking thing is amazing not gonna lie, I kinda wish I stayed here first. Anyways, we're about to get some food. I'm starving. I know the boys are too. So we're gonna go have some lunch and enjoy the city. I wanna be, like that's so cool. I mean, I don't wanna go on that thing, but it's kinda cool looking. And I've seen it at Vegas before, but I didn't know it was here at Lynx. Well, we just left flour and barley. We just had some pizza, me and my friends. And now they're gonna go do some stuff. I have to go back to my hotel and do my podcast interview. And then I think they're all gonna come over later for dinner. And then I go home, back to my life. Hey, Justin, hi. Oh, what up? I put him on all my vlogs all the time. He's always on my vlog. We'll talk later. Okay, so everybody has left my room for now. So I have some peace and quiet. Uh, it's so nice right now. I actually, I, I, I love this room. I, I was not expecting it to be an apartment. Like I looked at the floor plan and I was like, oh, it's kind of like a small apartment, but they gave me this two bedroom apartment and I'm here for one night. So I'm like in style, but because my friends are, I'm here and I'm visiting them. Anthony's going to make dinner. So they left to go get some stuff while I did my podcast interview. So my podcast interview starts in about 15 minutes to be about a 30 minute podcast and then I should be done. 
So, and it's for horror realm, horror realm. So we're definitely talking about film and grandma's cookies and stuff. So, um, should be awesome. And yeah. All right. So fingers crossed that this podcast goes well. And then I'll have the house full of people for a couple hours and then they'll leave. And then I'm just going to chill tonight. Um, cause that's what I want to do. I just want to chill tonight. I love everybody, but I want to have some time alone and then, um, they're going to pick me up tomorrow and take me to the airport. So all good stuff. Uh, I'm grateful to have good friends that want to hang out with me and I'm grateful that they're going to make me dinner tonight. I take them to lunch. They're going to make me dinner. It's all good. So, um, all right, I'll let you know how the podcast goes. And then I'm supposed to be coming back to Vegas next week, I believe, because they want to shoot Riker out here now. So we got to come out here and um, do some location scouting. So fun, fun, fun. Okay, I'm sitting out the front of this damn place. I'm waiting for Anthony to get here because he wants to make me dinner. And it's, uh, I had a, actually a really, so it's 7.30. I had a really amazing podcast interview. It was only supposed to be 30 minutes, but it went damn near an hour. Uh, the guy was great to talk to. He asked really awesome questions, not like questions I normally answer, which I loved. Um, sorry, so that was kind of amazing. Um, so it was a really good interview. It's supposed to come out probably in the next week. I think he says it's supposed to come out next week. And then he also is gonna do a review of Grandma's Cookies, so I'm really excited about seeing it. He said he liked the movie. He says, I like to interview the, the filmmakers before I do the review just in case and I go, oh, well, I mean, if you hate the movie, it's fine. Unless you said I was a shitty filmmaker, in which case I would still do your podcast. But no, he was fine. So, um, just now waiting for my friend Anthony to come over. So, but he said it was two minutes away and I'm sitting outside for two minutes and I didn't leave for another five. So, he, Anthony, you lied to me, but I'm outside. Uh, it's about... I took my glasses on. It says it's about 86. It doesn't feel that, but there's also a really nice breeze. I don't know if you can tell the trees are blowing. So it's definitely a nice breeze. It feels phenomenal. Um, but I heard in LA, there is, it's overcast and cold. So I bought my hoodie I can wear. Anthony, where are you? All right, I'm gonna wait for Anthony to get here. I don't know if you can see this, but they have a double-decker bus you can't see I know they got a double-decker bus that's kind of cool you don't see that outside of, outside of the US uh, oh there goes Anthony making some dinner what Anthony what are you, you making chicken parm, chicken parm. yeah Bro, no, that's salsa. Dude, Anthony that looks so good Anthony made his dinner Uh, well, everybody's gone now. Um, Anthony and his family and my friends. He made an amazing dinner. And we sat on the back patio here. Um, I got a shaver here. So I have, this, I have this porch that had four chairs. And it was just overlooking the pool. And it was a nice warm evening, but it wasn't like hot. And um, it was just a nice breeze. It really was lovely. So just sort of made for a nice, like evening you know what i'm happy because like i had a good time at the first hilton so i hugged with my friends made a new friend it was really nice and then here i come and i stay in this really nice hilton that's like a house it was amazing and i had more friends come and hang out here and i think tonight i feel lucky um I'm in this huge apartment alone, which I should have just had my um I should just have my friends stay. I wasn't technically allowed to have guests here, so I should just let them stay, but um it's fine. It's just it's so quiet. But I'm happy. I, I feel blessed to be able to have, you know, good friends that I was able to hang out with who, you know, have been having my my friends that I saw tonight just been having a rough week. Um, so I was able to give him just a nice, like, we had a nice dinner, Anthony made a nice dinner, and, well, we had lunch today, but we had a nice dinner, um, and we hung out, it was just quiet, you know, like, we just, 
got along. I know they've been, sorry, my nose is bad. I've been, I know that they were having a bad week. And tonight, I don't know, we just had a quiet night. It was chill, you know, it wasn't like, no one was yelling. It was just quiet. We were, played music. We had, we had dinner. It was lovely. And I, I'm, I'm glad that I had that because it's like really like a nice sort of like cap to the evening, you know, to my weekend. And uh, my flight doesn't leave till five tomorrow, but I have to be out of the ho out of here by eleven. So um, that'll be nice, you know, because um, I have a few hours and I'm hang out with them. And then they're actually going to be nice enough to take me to the airport, which I'm grateful for. And uh, my friend Dustin that I was with flies out like fucking seven in the morning, so he'll be landing. I feel like, I'm so sorry it's because I'm in bed. He'll be landing just as I'm getting up, so. But we had a good visit. I'm very, very grateful. I'll go home tomorrow. I got a busy week of just stuff I got to take care of. And then back on the road because we got to come back out here next weekend to uh, do some location scouting for Riker. So you'll be with me on that adventure then, without a doubt. But in the meantime, I am off to bed. Thank you so much for listening. Hope everybody had a great weekend. And... Tomorrow's Monday, so let's embrace this week and make it the best we can do.